Hi everyone, welcome to the series solving SQL interview questions. In this video, we'll be solving an SQL interview question asked at Salesforce. The problem that we are solving today is highest target under manager. Find the highest target achieved by the employee or employees who work under the manager ID 13. Output the first name of the employee and target achieved. The solution should show the highest target achieved under manager ID 13 and which employees have achieved it. So this is our problem and the table that we are given is the Salesforce employees. According to our approach, the first step of solving the SQL query is understanding the inputs and the outputs. By looking at the question, they are asking us to calculate the highest target, right? Do we have any target column? Yes, so one of my inputs is going to be target and they want this target which was achieved by the employees who work under the manager ID 13. So there's also a column called as manager ID. So manager ID and target are going to be my inputs. What will be my outputs? Output the first name of the employee and the target achieved. The solution should show the highest target achieved under the managerial ID 13 and which employees have achieved it. So these are going to be my inputs and the outputs. Now the second step of our approach is articulating the solution verbally to the interviewer. In our question, they've asked us to calculate the highest target achieved by the employee under the manager ID 13. So the first step of my approach is going to be filtering out all the employees who come under the manager ID 13 using the where clause. Now in this where clause, I also have to include the people who have achieved the highest target. Now, how will I get that highest target? By using a subquery with the aggregate function max. So in the subquery, I'm going to get the maximum of the target achieved by the employees under the manager ID 13. And this can be one employee or multiple employees. So my where clause will contain manager ID is equal to 13 and all the employees who have achieved the maximum target under the manager ID 13. And this will give me the final output, which is the highest target achieved by all the employees under the manager ID 13. So this is going to be my approach. Now the third step of our approach is constructing the query step by step. And the first part of our query construction is filtering out all the employees that come under the manager ID 13. So let me just come back here and say, instead of select star, I'm going to say first name and target because those are our outputs from Salesforce employees. And my filter is going to be where manager ID is equal to 30. And I'm going to run this. And as you can see, these are all the employees who are under the manager ID 13. Now the second part of our query construction is getting the list of the highest target achieved employees. For that, as we've discussed, we'll be using a subquery with the operator and in the same where clause. And target is equal to highest achieved target employees list. And how are we getting that with the subquery? Select max of target from the table sales force employees where manager id is equal to 13. So I'm going to simply run this code as you can see, so these three are the people who have achieved the highest target under the manager ID 13. So yeah, this is how you approach this problem. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.